A wrestling bout is a physical competition between two competitors who attempt to gain and maintain a superior position. Wrestling in high school has become a popular sport, with fans packing it in to see who is crowned champion at the state finals. When you think of wrestling, you think of a brotherhood or even a fraternity. So imagine when a female joins the team. Well, right here at Monroe High School, a successful Austrian exchange student, Victoria Schindler, walked into school one day and did just that. Yeah, my dad is a wrestling coach. He was a wrestler when he was young. Both of my grandpas, they were wrestlers and wrestling coaches. And one of my uncles, he's still a wrestler. We've never had a girl. I've never coached a girl at this level uh, before. So it was a little apprehensive about, I was a little apprehensive about how she was going to be accepted. I was a little iffy about it just because of, uh, you know, girls wrestling, you know, it kind of doesn't mix. I was kind of scared that a girl would be on our team because I didn't, I didn't, I've never wrestled a girl, so I didn't know what to expect. Yeah, the first practice, it was really weird. I was a little bit scared before to meet all the guys because I didn't know how they will react when they see the girls coming to the team. Her credentials are not what earned her respect with the Monroe wrestling team. It was her hard work and determination as a competitor that did. She's like a sponge out there. Um, she just wants to be taught. She just wants to learn. If I could take that attitude from her and put it into my other wrestlers who are more physically gifted, it'd be awesome. She's never got a negative attitude. She's always willing to go out there and try. She's, she's come a long way. I mean, she wrestles hard, she practices hard. I mean, all the good mentalities. She met all of our expectations. She's a great teammate. She's a, a, really, a really nice young lady and uh, she works hard. I wish, I wish I could take her heart and her work ethic and put in some of my better talented wrestlers. <laughs> some people might blow her off like, oh, if she's a girl, I can beat her. Oh, she's a girl, she's gonna be easier, like, uh, oh, she can't be that good or anything, but then they have another thing coming. She would go out and she would beat some guys and she would beat them repeatedly. Yeah, she, she came through with a couple clutch matches that we really needed to win. Uh, Ann Arbor Pioneer, if we wouldn't have, she wouldn't have won that match, we would have lost. Some opponents um, refused to wrestle her. Some opponents voided her weight class when they saw that it was a female. We teach our young men to be proper. We teach our young men not to grab a girl and not to hold her in a certain position or, or touch her in a certain way. But well, when you're wrestling, there's no getting around that. You're body to body contact and some, some young, young men can deal with that and some guys can't. For the most part, I think every one of her opponents were um, stand up guys and they went out and they wrestled her hard and they wrestled her hard, my team wrestled her hard, and we didn't give her any leeway because she was a girl. I, I had talked to them beforehand, and I said, listen, don't, until we understand what we have, don't, don't treat her any differently. Go out there and wrestle hard with her, and um, don't, don't go easy on her, because you're not gonna do her any favors. And she met that challenge, she met that challenge head on. Vicki's great personality and humility won over hearts even before she came to America. She fits in well. Um, when we picked her up from the airport, well, before we picked her up from the airport, we developed a relationship over Skype. And when she flew in, um, we got to the airport, and as she was walking up the aisle, we literally ran to each other and connected in a hug. It was that kind of a bond. She's very humble. She doesn't like a lot of attention. Um, but she's, she's very friendly, very outgoing. Um, we enjoy having her in the house. Um, she has a really good sense of humor, like sometimes we don't understand when she's being sarcastic because she, her, uh, of her accent, but then she, she'll laugh at us and explain that she was joking, so she's, she's a lot of fun. I, I like the school a lot, and the people, they're really nice. <laughs> the team spirit and like, practice is different here. It's, I'm much more motivated here than I was in Austria. Like it's in Austria, it's more individually. We don't wrestle for the team; we just wrestle for ourselves. Like even, even like the team breakdowns or just cheering on, we don't do this. <laughs> Vicky will have many great stories to tell her family when she returns to Austria, including her tales of wrestling right here at Monroe High School. One thing is for sure, though. She's opened the minds of many and been an inspiration to all. For the MHSAA Network, I'm Todd Weber.